Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Hassan and today we will work on WooCommerce. So today we will add product countdown in our WooCommerce product. Before starting work, it's my request. Please subscribe my channel. Thank you. Now back to our work. So we will add product countdown in our WooCommerce product through plugin. So we are using this plugin today. Why ITH WooCommerce product countdown? So we are using this in our WordPress website and this is pro plugin and another one is sale countdown timer. So you see I already install it and activate it but you cannot use this plugin for individual pro uh, product. You cannot add short code to specific product because one short code is used for all product like i will show you this is countdown timer and click on countdown timer so it's open and now scroll down you see sale countdown timer so short code sale countdown timer id sale countdown timer so you will add this code in product if you want to add different countdown timer for different product so this plugin will not work for that purpose because this plugin short code work for all product for same purpose and same countdown timer so you can't change or add different product countdown timer for different products so that's why we are using this woocommerce product countdown so when we will uh, use this then we will add different product countdown for different product individually or bulk so now we are installing it go to dashboard and click on plugin and add new upload plugin choose file and this is plugin so install now so plugin is installed and then click on activate plugin so plugin is activated now so here you see why ith plugin for deck countdown so click on it and now you see setting general setting enable why ith woocommerce for deck countdown and select type port timer and sale bar timer only sale bar only so you can select according to your requirement select position category and product detail page category is only product detail page only with a short code only so you can select according to your requirement short time before sale start so click on it disable product before sale start so it's depend on you so you can enable or disable this and now you see behavior on expiration or sold out hide countdown when uh, time uh, timer done then hide it and show sale somebody if you want only if product is under if product all sold out then show sale somebody and now timer and scale bar position product page where you want to show timer before title after price so you can select according to your requirement i select before title and category where you want to show timer and sale bar position so you can select position according to your requirement and short code setting so you can select all and here widget setting select all and then click on save changes so click on it so changes save now so click on customization and now you see customization setting timer title sale ends in timer title before sale starts so you can change title according to your requirement on sale there are uh, three styles style one this one you want style two and style three so you can select according to your requirement and then you see color and font size and you can change setting according to your requirement and change color then click on work operation 
so now you see product to assign there are multiple option here assigned to selection of a product assigned to a category assigned to all recent product assigned to all on sale product and assigned to all feature product so this is bulk operation perform on all uh, specific product like we are in assigned to a selection of product now we will go to product to assign count timer individually so this is product all product and this is our product now click on any product like this edit so product is open and now scroll down and you see product countdown click on it and now you see enable why iti woocommerce product countdown for this product so enable it and this is good we can't do bulk operation in setting but this is good we can do the setting uh, for product one by one and according to our requirements so count on sales start like today we select and end with 30. now you see discounted products so i think 10 is enough for this sale when 10 products sold out then this sale will over also so you can add a product according to your requirement and then click on update and now refresh the home uh, shop page and scroll down you see countdown to upcoming sale start in 1 hour 25 minute 42 second on sale 0 by 10 sold when 10 products sold then this sale will be over and when open the product so now you see countdown to upcoming sale 1 hour 25 minute on sale this is bar you can change this color and all things on in back and setting here yt th plugin open it so you can change all the style and setting colors in customization section here you see different style uh, title color so and also if you want to do bulk operation then click on it and you can perform bulk operation on products category uh, sale product uh, recent product so you can do according to your requirement and now go back to product so this is our product and now if we change the date make for click on save and refresh the page again now you see sales ends in 26 days 1 hour 22 minutes 34 second and on sale product is 10 so when 10 is sold out then this sale will end so in this way you can add product countdown in woocommerce i hope you like this video please like comment share and subscribe thank you for watching